Tape Script 5.7 Don't Log Off with Alan Dine Part 1 Hello? Hello! Hello, is this Brian? Yes, this is Brian. Hi, how are you? I first spoke with Brian 18 months ago. I dedicate my lunch hour normally to uh, chat with my uh, girlfriend, Anna, that I met online. I was just browsing profiles in Russia, (laughs) and I stumbled across the most beautiful woman in the world. (laughs) But this was more than just a typical online romance. Do you speak Russian? No, I'm learning to speak Russian. And does Anna speak English? No, not yet. She's trying to learn English, too. (laughs) So I began to chat with her using uh, Google Translator. That's how the relationship continued. Brian and Anna relying on online translation to communicate. I say that you were both lost in translation, but in fact you're, you found each other through translation. <laughs> this was the first of numerous conversations with Brian. Hello? Hello, Brian. The next time, he'd been to visit Anna in Russia. Uh, something, let me tell you. It took me over 24 hours just to get there. Did you feel that it all was exactly how you thought it would be in your mind? Oh, yes. The physical, spiritual, mental connection, everything was there. Six months later... Hello? Hello, Alan. Brian had some big news for me. We just decided we were going to get married and... (laughs) Anna and her two children will be leaving Russia and moving to America. And the amazing thing is, this whole relationship is still relying on online translation. Neither Brian nor Anna speak each other's languages. She's left the only home she's ever known all her life, basically. Anna and her children were on their way. She's coming to a country where she's never been. She's never even been on an airplane before. I spoke with Brian at the airport on the night of their arrival. She should be here any minute, but it had to have landed. They were all going to come over on a three-month visa. There's some people coming up the escalator here. Anna has to get married to Brian within those three months. Otherwise, Anna and the children have to return to Russia. And I still don't see... You guys coming from New York? No. <gasps> Here she is! There she is! I missed her! <laughs> oh! <laughs> I missed you too! Oh! <laughs> She's here. (laughs) Brian, this is a very special moment. Yes. Okay, well, she just told me to get off the phone. (laughs) So, Al? Well, Brian, may I wish you good luck, and I look forward to catching up with you shortly. Okay. Uh, You can call me in the next few days, probably. And it was then that I had an idea. I was thinking it would be a wonderful experience to visit you and Anna in Boise, Idaho. Oh, wow. To see you in person and to kind of capture your life with Anna now. That would be, that would be, uh, that would be interesting, yes. <laughs> <laughs> but you never know, that might fit in to your wedding plans. Yes, I, I, th- I think it would definitely uh, take it up to the next level. Brian set the wedding date for the 21st of September and I booked the plane tickets so I could be there. But then okay, um, I received a rather worrying message. Um, so this is really big news. 